Summer is here, so that means it's grilling season. If you're looking for flavorful meats to grill, then John's Butcher Shop has you covered. They have been family owned and operated since 1941. Here to talk about the shop and to tell us about some mouthwatering meats are Anita and Jamie. Ladies, good morning, it's Justin. Good morning, good morning. Oh, I'm already drooling. We're about to eat some steak <laughs> and it's not even 10 a.m. yet. Uh, if somebody walks into John's Butcher Shop for the first time, Anita, what would you want them to notice? Our customer service, we like to greet them, ask them how they're doing, see if we can help them with anything and let them look around. What kind of variety of meats do you have in the shop, Jamie? Uh, we have a variety of different steaks. We have over 20 different flavors of brats. Uh, we marinate our own chicken breast. We have just a variety of everything. <laughs> What's popular right now? Fourth of July is looming. What have you a noticed? Lot We're a, lot a lot of brats. A lot of brats. A lot of brats. A lot, a lot of brats, that, that is tremendous. So what are your, some of your favorite types of meat? I like the Hawaiian brats, those are my favorite. Hawaii, so how many flavors, how many, like, what are some different flavors that you have other than just kind of the traditional uh, We have brat? original brats, we have cheddar brats, Hawaiian brats. So that's got cheese inside yep. it? Yep. That's, that sounds yep. fun when you cut in it, it kind of explodes yep. with cheese. We have a new Philly cheesesteak brat. Mm -hmm. That's, we just, that's been out maybe a couple weeks. It's selling really good. Uh, we have jalapeno brats onion brats, garlic brats. And Anita, you do bulk orders too, like, like yep. large yep. orders. What, what is that process like if somebody's trying to maybe cook for a large family reunion or something like that? We have pre-made bundles that you can find or that we sell, or we can custom make a bundle, How, whatever you want. What kind of seasonings do you recommend for some of these meats? Because it can't just be about the meat. You need that kind of sauce and flair and flavor. We have a seasoning for our steaks, and then we have a different one that we use for our pork and poultry. What are some good grilling tips that you might offer? Because I'm sure somebody's at the counter and they might go, hey, Anita, hey, Jamie, you know, how would I cook this sirloin? What would you tell them? We answer those questions custom to, for what the customer wants or is looking for. But for the most time, we just tell them how long to grill them or pan fry them or however they want to make them. All right, you brought a couple of your favorite meats here on the coffee table. What'd you bring for us, Jamie and Anita? Uh, we have a New York strip. We have a ribeye and a T-bone. I feel like they're just, they're cut perfect because it's got that marble, <laughs> that marble sear to it. What, what, what's the process in the butcher shop to make it so thick but not kind of overwhelmingly fatty or anything like that? We can cut them to whatever thickness you want. Those are about right at an inch and a quarter. You mind if I touch one here? Nope, go ahead. Wow. So this is, this is really tender, it's flavorful. Yep. I feel like the fat to meat ratio is perfect here. How do you it's like your good. meats, Anita, if you were cooking at home with your family? I like a little more fat, I like the flat. That's almost the best part, but I like them medium. We would do a steak like that maybe about 10 minutes each side. 10 minutes each side, and so you're so good. You can, you can actually make it so it's not burnt on the outside, but it's still juicy on the inside. How do you do that? <laughs> you sear it really fast to make a crust on it, and then that seals the juices in. Well, I'm gonna show our viewers here at home. This steak is just absolutely fantastic. It is lovely. It's a ribeye from John's Butcher Shop. There it is right there. Look at that perfect marble, perfect thickness there. This is absolutely phenomenal. And you guys have weekly specials every week yes, too. We that do. starts what, on, on Tuesdays? Tuesdays through Saturdays, yep. So that's gotta be fun. Is there a big sign and people are probably into the weekly specials? Yep. They're on Facebook or you can sign up for an email list to get them weekly. Now you got a T-bone here as well. So this is like the best of both worlds. I feel like the best part about the T-bone is like cutting the meat off and then eating it like corn on the cob. <laughs> yep. would, you, would you agree with yep. me, Jamie? Uh, you could do that, yes, absolutely. How long have you been at the shop, Anita? A long time. A long time. 26 years. <laughs> but, but you love it, right? When you I like do. what you do, you don't work a day I in your do. life. Yep, that's true. Uh, Jamie, how, how is the shop for you? What's the vibe like working with Anita and all your, all your co it's colleagues? It's great, everyone's laid back. Um, we treat our customers the same way. We try to have the, you know, we have a lot of original customers that have been there for a long time and you get to know your customers by name. Oh, this tea, it smells phenomenal. I know it's raw, but it already smells phenomenal. Uh, do you just love the aroma of John's Butcher Shop? I, I feel like it's just a meteria galore, right? Yep. It is. Yep, it is. Ladies, this was awesome. We appreciate all the tips. Fourth of July is coming up. This is going to be awesome. These T-bones are absolutely wonderful, as well as all your meats in the shop. For more information on John's Butcher Shop, check out your screen. There's their website. Give Anita and her team a call. They're also on Facebook to find their weekly specials.